एट मेंबर्स ऑफ ए क्लब डोनेट रुपीज हंड्रेड ईच टूवर्ड्स अ रिलीफ फंड एंड द प्रेजिडेंट ऑफ द क्लब डोनेट रुपीज फिफ्टी मोर देन द एवरेज डोनेशन ऑफ ऑल ऑफ दम इंक्लूडिंग द प्रेजिडेंट देन द कॉन्ट्रीब्यूशन ऑफ द प्रेजिडेंट इज सो बेसिकली देर आर एट मेंबर्स इन ए क्लब एंड ईच ऑफ दम डोनेट रुपीज हंड्रेड टूवर्ड्स अ रिलीफ फंड द प्रेजिडेंट ऑफ द क्लब डोनेट फिफ्टी मोर देन द एवरेज डोनेशन ऑफ ऑल ऑफ दम and this all of them includes the president as well right so what is the contribution of the president is a question what is the contribution of the president without putting pen on paper within no time you should eliminate option 3 why answer cannot be less than 100 remember answer cannot be less than 100 why is it so see members themselves have donated rupees 100 each we know that the president has donated more than the average donation see if all the eight members have donated 100 average is 100 Including the president, there will be some average. The president has donated fifty more than that average. The president has donated fifty more than the average. So answer has to be, answer has to be more than hundred. In fact, answer has to be more than one fifty. So you can also eliminate option one here. You getting it? Option one and option three get eliminated within no time. One and three get eliminated within no time because average of the members is hundred. Eight members donated hundred rupees each. Average is hundred. The president donated fifty more. Even if we don't include the president, even if we do not include the president in the group, president's donation will be how much? Hundred plus fifty, one fifty. In fact, it will be more than one fifty, right? When the president is included, so one not six and fifty six get eliminated straight. Possible answers are one fifty six point two five and two not six point two five. Let's say if one more option is get you know gets eliminated using this uh, method or technique that we have used, we are done. We don't have to solve the question at all. But now that we have two options. Left one fifty six point two five into one six point two five. We have to do some calculation, right? So let's see what the calculation is. See, let us find out the donation of the president. Let's assume the president has donated p rupees. How will you calculate this p? P should be equal to c. The president of the club donates fifty more than the average donation of all of them. What do you mean by average donation? See, eight members have donated hundred each, plus the president has donated p. So what is the total donation? Eight into hundred plus p. Eight members donated hundred each, so eight hundred plus the president donated p rupees. This is the total donation divided by nine is the average. Eight into hundred plus p divided by nine. This is the average, right? Total by number of members, nine members. Remember, there are total nine members, including the president. The president donated fifty more than the average, so this is the average plus fifty. President donated fifty more than the average, so plus fifty on the average. Average is eight hundred plus p by nine. Solve for p. Only one equation, one variable. You can solve. Solve for p. What happens? We get, you know, I mean, I'm directly solving it. You, like I said, you don't have to write every step on paper, right? So cut down the number of steps. You should be able to do the calculation mentally. Nine p minus p, eight p. Nine p minus p, eight p equals two. This will be eight hundred plus. See this nine. Before you multiply with p, you have to multiply with fifty here. Nine is the LCM basically. So this fifty becomes four fifty. You're able to follow. So this fifty becomes four fifty, and this nine becomes LCM. So nine p minus eight, nine p minus p, eight p equals to eight hundred plus four fifty, twelve fifty. So p will be equal to twelve fifty by eight. Twelve fifty by eight will be one fifty six point two five. That's your answer, right? So one fifty six point two five. Option two is the answer.